Hey, what's going on legends? Welcome back. So in the last couple of videos, we learned how to add effects with Final Cut Pro 10. We learned how to add video effects. We learned how to add audio effects. We learned how to be precise with those effects using keyframes. And now I'm going to talk about copying and pasting those effects. So say you have the perfect clip, whether it's color or the perfect uh, audio volume or the perfect video effect and you wanna copy and paste that without doing the whole process over to every individual clip that you plan on doing it to. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and create, let's look at this clip right here. I'm gonna do Command Plus just to zoom in. Now I'm gonna copy it with Command C. Now what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna paste it. So I'm gonna wait until I've got the beginning of this clip right here. We're gonna see the L and R. There it is right there. So I'm gonna click, uh, Command V on a Mac. And uh, that's it. I got the same clip back to back, just like that. There's nothing going on. There's actually not even any audio. This is going to be a pretty less is more simple tutorial. Uh, and that's it. Just like that. So let's say, um, and f for anybody worried about the whole copy and paste thing. Yeah. If you want to copy a clip, you got to make sure you're at the end of a clip. So say you just want to copy and paste this. It's not just going to jump this over here. It's going to divide this clip up right here. So I'm going to do copy command V right there. Look, it just intersected that completely. I don't want to do that. I'm going to do command Z to undo that. So at any point of this clip right here, wherever you just command V, it's going to chop that up. So we've got like what 80% of the clip right here, command V just like that. It's got 20% to the right of it and 80% to the left of it. Command Z. So make sure you've got, if you want to do what I did, you got to wait for that little L to show up. Let you know when that clip is done. Just like that. So, okay. Copy and paste. Okay. So let's get back into it. So I'm just going to throw a couple of clips out. I'll do a black and white. Um, I will do, let's go to nostalgia. We'll do some security. Let's look at this clip. So keep in mind, this does not look good. Doesn't look bad. Kind of looks like something very 50s, maybe OK Corral kind of Western. So say that we spent an hour on that and we played around with the color. We played around with the audio. What you're going to want to do is not just do, you're going to do command copy for the clip, but you're not going to do command V to paste. What we need to pull up is our paste attributes. Now the keyboard shortcut for that is shift command V, or you can go up here and take the long way home, paste attribute, shift command B, uh, but I like being dependent on keyboard shortcuts. So I'm gonna do shift command V just like that. And here it is, it's got our video attributes as well as our audio attributes. Now by default, we've got the transform, the crop, the distort, and the stuff that shows up uh, automatically by default. What we don't have by default is the things that we've added to it. So this is it, our effects right here. Now you can click on all these, but it's not gonna make a difference because these two clips are the exact same aside from these effects that we did right here. So what I'm gonna do is we did color correction, did we? No, I'm just gonna do the black and the white and the security, just like that. Now I'm gonna click paste. We didn't do anything audio, nothing to worry about. We got cartoon animals voice, but I, I dummied the effect all the way down. That's it, black and white security, just like that, paste. Now let's look at this clip. The second clip should now be the exact same as the first. There it is. Now keep in mind, this was a pretty simple tutorial. Uh, you wouldn't really do this. I mean, you could really do this, but this is for the times where you really spend maybe significant amount of time working on a clip, honing in the color, uh, honing in the correct audio. Maybe there's certain keyframes. kind of in a couple of videos ago, and we did that monster voice, how we kind of gradually worked up to it and then worked our way down to it. And uh, yeah, so that is how you uh, copy and paste in Final Cut Pro 10. It is not Command V, it is Command V Shift. Hopefully this made sense, good luck with this. You guys are all legends, I'll see you in the next video. If you guys have any questions, post them in the comment section below. And uh, great job so far, I'll see you guys in the next video.